Hello, Simon Calder here at Gatwick Airport. I think I'm spending a bit too long here. I was here earlier in the week after EasyJet confirmed to me that they have cancelled 1,700 flights over the next couple of months in a, an attempt to build some resilience into their schedules after what they say are very severe air traffic control problems in Europe. But I'm now back because four ground handling companies, which represent pretty much all the big airlines at Gatwick, apart from Emirates, are facing walkouts by their ground staff. Now, the handling companies do everything from checking passengers in to loading and unloading the bags to dispatching the aircraft. They are absolutely essential. Nearly 1,000 of them working for ASC, which uh, represents uh, handles for TUI, working for GGS, which looks after British Airways and also um, Vueling, its sister airline from Spain. On top of that, you've got DHL, who are looking after, among others, EasyJet, the biggest airline here, and then finally Menzies Aviation, who will represent uh, Wizz Air and some other airlines. The union says, and this is the Unite Union, that these workers are paid a pittance. They do extremely important safety critical work, very unsocial hours, very highly pressurised, and they need a decent pay rise. For passengers who are booked on two of the peak weekends of the year, this is extremely worrying news, especially as right now you can't do anything other than effectively say, well, sit on your hands and uh, cross your fingers, which is um, quite uncomfortable. They are not going to allow you to change or cancel your booking at this stage. If we get to a few days before a strike and there is uh, no look, no possibility of a settlement then there will be options put in which I would think typically would include allowing you to uh, shift flights although availability is extremely tight this summer as you may have discerned so it's all looking pretty grim but if I were a passenger I would take some heart from the uh, sense that I've seen lots and lots of ground handling disputes. I've seen some strikes called before but they very often get settled um, quite briskly and certainly talking to ground handlers here they say the uh, ground handling companies have underestimated the strength of feeling among the workers and now they are very very keen to get a settlement. We shall see what happens but at the moment and um, please bear in mind there is nothing you can do except sit and wait and hope for the best. If it does all go wrong for you under European air passenger rights rules you are entitled to have your uh, replacement flight. Um, you're allowed, you're supposed to get accommodation and meals but at peak summer with everything at full stretch I'm afraid uh, that's easier to say than perhaps it is to achieve. I'll keep you informed. Meanwhile, thank you very much indeed for watching.